Hey guys, this is Jimmy Bojangles here, and welcoming you to a new Let's Play, Commander Keen Dreams, also known as Commander Keen 3.5 or Commander Keen 7, depending on who you talk to. It's really actually Commander Keen 3.5. It came out in between the Commander Keen 1 to 3 and 4, 5, 6, or 4 and 5 and then 6, I guess. I'd, whatever, however the line of them goes. Um, this is a very big departure from the rest of the Commander King series. Um, for one, you're in your pajamas. It looks a lot like the Galaxy series, but you can't grab onto ledges. Um, there's no music. Uh, what else? Jeez, it's, uh, it's a pretty fun game. Um, enemies come back to life after you shoot them, which is a pretty big difference, in my humble opinion. And, let's see, what else is there? This is actually published by Softdisk and not by Apogee. Uh. So, um, that's one thing to look out for, probably why it's such a huge-ass departure. Um, hmm, not really much else to say. You still jump around. Oh, you don't have a pogo stick in this game, which is another big, uh, differentiation between every other team game in this. There we go, Horse Rider Shells, done. Um... As with any keen game, you have a world map that you can go around on and go to different levels. Let's go to Brussels Bread Bay. This level isn't very long or hard or full of semen. Whoa, those are called broccoli ashes. They like to headbang and generally act like douches towards you. You are going to want to farm ammo in this game because you will run out, because you will miss your shots, because the curvature on your shots sucks. And they just stop moving after a while. Who frickin' raw? Um, if I remember correctly, this level is not actually required. You actually, technically, you can just go beat the game once you get a few boobus bombs. That's another thing. Unlike every... Wow, I'm doing bad. Unlike every other keen game, this actually has a boss. Fuck it, I'm out. There's another level done. Sweet. Okay. Uh, this... I'm, in, unless I'm completely mistaken, this game actually doesn't support in-level saving like every other Commander Keen. Or rather, Keen 4, 5, and 6. Um, let's see. Apples, ac Apple Acres. Boobus Bombs and Near. Okay, um, I think, yeah. These Apple Monsters will actually climb up and down uh, poles as they see them. But they will drop off the blorp, I should have looked. Look before you leap, folks. Look before you leap. Look before you gleep. I should be getting that ammo, too. I don't even know what those are supposed to be. I think they're like seeds or something. Take my seed, you dirty apple. <coughs> yeah, I'm going to hell. I knew this a long time ago. I've come to peace with it. Don't worry, guys. There ain't no place for me like hell. I love it. I was in a wonderful, magical place where little men in red pajamas were poking my butt with a pitchfork. Okay, um... As you can see, this is a lot closer related to... I say as you can see way too fucking much. Uh, but anyway, this game is a lot more closely related to the Galaxy series than the uh, Vorticon series. Because... Well, it uses the same friggin' sprite minus the fact that he's wearing bunny slippers. Uh, well, what can you do? Alright, so let's see if we can't find the boobus bombs in this level. If I remember correctly, they're down here. But I don't, I don't, know, I don't really, really want to chance that. Oh my god, this jump. I'm totally gonna die to that fire on the way back. Fuck fire! Get money! Okay. That went so, so much better than I thought it was going to. I thought this was just gonna be Shitstorm all, all Shitstorm 013. Yeah, Shitstorm 013. One other thing that I find really annoying about this damn game is that you can't fucking look up and down. Oh, I remember. The boobus bombs are up here. They're on top of this platform, and I can never figure out how to get up there. But I will this time, just for you guys. 
Or maybe it's just prime up here. Oh, there's some booba spawns. Let's get over here. And let's see if there's... Yeah, that's how you get that. Okay, cool. So now we have three booba spawns. If we look at our stat menu there, there's uh, three there. I cannot for the life of me remember how many you need to kill them, so I'm probably going to collect about eight or nine. Because you can miss, and you can fuck up. There we go, Apple Orchard done. Or whatever the fuck that level is called. Oof. Spud City. I remember having a horrible time with this level. When I was a kid. French Fry Guys are one of the few shooting enemies in this game. They are. I think they're called Frenchies. Good old racist DOS games. Good old racism. I haven't the foggiest inside of a goat's thigh how long this game is going to take for me to beat, but I will probably call this recording. Oh, as you can see, some of these mosquitoes are just slightly off-colored. And that means that you can jump on them. And that was not worth it. 10,000 points. Ugh. Keen has just a little bit of momentum in this game, which makes him really, really fucking hard to control in the air. I also highly recommend that if you're going to jump down from somewhere without knowing where you're going, uh, it's just a good idea in general to um, fire shots underneath you, because you can pick them up after you throw them. That's no big deal. Um... Oh god, so sketched out. As you can see, like, before they disappear, you can still pick them up. I can see all sorts of- oh, there we go. Oh, well that's totally worth it, guys. Yeah, I'm totally gonna throw myself down the fucking- No, no way in hell. Screw that. Screw that in the bottom. I'm not going for that cookie either, because it's just not worth it! Maybe if I was better at keen? Maybe. Die! Die, all you stupid potato net bastards! This is where those horseradish dudes start to get a little bit sketchy. Um, in fact, I'm really sketched out right now. Oh, there we go. Let's grab this guy, jumped up here, this must be where the boobus palms are. If and I had to guess. Blind jump, blind jump, that's what I love. Like, until you play this game, you don't really appreciate how much better the Galaxy engine is. Like, oh my god. If you play this first, then... Like, if you were to play this after Keen 1, 2, and 3, it would just look like such a huge improvement over those games. But if you were to play it like I did after I played Keen 4 and 5 and 6, oh my god, there's some things you take as just being a, um, whoa, okay. That's what I mean. Chucking shit underneath yourself is a great idea because you can die so easily just from falling down. Oh my god. If I had died there, I would have been so freaking pissed. Having to do all that over again, getting my damn booba spawns all over again. Man, I'm having a good run of this game. I haven't even played this in probably a year or two. So, Jesus, um, one, two, three, four. I think I'm pretty much half done the game. Just for good measure, let's go do the last really short level. Bridge bottoms. Um, if you really want to, I'm gonna show this. I'm probably I'm gonna try once. I'll try once. And if I mess it up, I'm not trying again. Uh, there's another secret path on here. Take the slightly purpler uh, mosquitoes. And jump across this pit. Fuck! No, I'm not trying that again. It's such a pain in the ass. But, um... Now, you can exit the level right there. But, as with most short levels in the King series, there are secrets out the wall, too. I'm not going to go for that flower, because quite frankly, I'm probably not going to need that many shots before I finish. There's a Brocka Lash down here, so be careful. Be aware. Beware doesn't mean be afraid. It means be aware. 
Run! And then there's another exit down here, so you don't have to worry about getting your ass back up there. Um. I don't have any music to sing along with and make up funny lyrics. Probably involving the word anal. So, kind of at a loss now for what to talk about. Um. Yeah, I'll do one more level. Let's try Rhubarb Rapids. I'm probably gonna die. Just saying. Let's see, I think I remember how to do this level. Surprisingly, this game's a little bit more fresh in my head than uh, Team 5 for some reason. Yo, squash motherfucker! Let's just knock those bastards out. Key down here or is the door down there? I think the door is down there, so I'm not gonna bother you. That's how you do that. Not messing around for that other one. And now the trick is once you get the key, that you have to kind of force, brute force your way out of here. Which is just done by jumping around there. Really hard, right, guys? Oh, and I missed my jump. Wunderbar! Of course, as with any keen game, you fall down the bottomless pit, you die! So, careful of that. <laughs> um, I'm kind of lucky, and I cleared that squash out of there first. I recommend making him jump off that first. Screw it. Fuck you, potato man. Screw you, potato moto! No more asparagus. Oh my god, that was so lucky. I think I just shit myself. That was an evil tomato. Oh. Oh yeah, there's... I fragging forgot. I fraglin forgot. Alright, so there's one way you can go to get Boobus Bombs, and a key, another key. But the way you want to go to actually beat this level is over here. Over shnya. Oh, come on. If I, I, R, C, it's... Wait, what? Huh? guys. I'm seriously confused. I'm going to cut to when I actually find the door. Because apparently I'm retarded. Oh. Okay, well I guess I'm an idiot and thought something was a bottomless pit when it was really just a... What? No! <sighs> Mad amounts of AIDS. Okay, guys, <laughs> we're back, and I've made an executive decision because I've died, like, fucking five times in a row here. I'm just going to finish the level, because I've wasted, like, all of my shots, all my patience, and everything trying to get those three goddamn boobus bombs. Well, I'm pretty damn sure I already have enough to beat the game. So fuck that, I'm leaving. <laughs> That's enough of that bullshit. Um... So yeah, I think that's going to be it for now. Next time on Commander Keen Dreams, we're going to be getting into the grape level. Grapes. Grape. Mad grape. Alright, ladies and gents, thanks for watching Let's Play Keen Dream. Be thankful you didn't get to see me fucking freaking out and punching my computer in the middle of that stupid level, but whatever. Have fun. Thanks for watching. Penis. Why?